Now, away from that, a former NDC Deputy General Secretary, Koku Anidoho, says his decision to go to court is to prove that the expulsion from the party was based on false allegations. He spoke exclusively to my colleague, Jifa Bampo. I'm a free Ghanaian. Yes, I still owe allegiance to the party, if I so wish. But Jifa, I'm a Ghanaian, and I have my Twitter handle. Why, the NDC also has its Twitter handles. So why don't why, why they don't tweet? Where in the NDC's constitution does it say that before you tweet anything, you must seek clearance from the party? Certainly, fact, certainly fact, not seeking fact, clearance, fact, article, but fact, if, article the tweets, 47, if the listen, tweets are, you know, that Ghana is offensive. Not the, that, that Ghana, no, that, that what? Ghana is not the banana republic. So let me read some of them. You said, Asedu Nketia made a big mistake to pick a senseless fight with me. How can a spineless mosquito pick up a fight with a determined bull? Do you have to how, really how, how, go how, into how a do, tirade? How do you, it's not a tirade. And of course, even these ones that you are reading have nothing to do, I believe, with the so-called initial petition. No. Exactly. Yeah. So these but are these just, these just add-ons. These are, okay. These are just, so you admit that these are add-ons. These are, these are just okay. add-ons. I but mean. The, so there's been no word since the ultimatum you gave for the no. revocation of the letter. No, and, I know you indicated you may seek legal action. Is that still on the table? It's still on the table very much so. You know what I mean? If you go and write that I have been engaged in anti-party conduct, and indiscipline, two very broad, amorphous, amoeba-like terms that can be subjected to abuse. And if you read this letter that I wrote, I have said that what really is anti-party conduct? So you said um, you pursue legal action? Well, yes. I think that um, under the circumstances, Jifa, I'm a citizen of Ghana. Beyond NDC, I am also currently the founder and the CEO of the Atamils Institute, a duly, properly registered private think tank, civic education, public policy advocacy. I use my good image and my good integrity to run this thing. So I will not sit down for a certain Johnson, Kwejo Asedun Ketia. And listen, and listen, this letter, out of his malicious perfidy. How do you know it's malice? Because I know everything that he's done is tainted by malice and perfidy. He didn't file the petition. Well, sir. that's what I'm saying. When we get into open court, they will, they will get to know, we'll get to the bottom of the matter.